Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. That snicker, poach, a silly, par uh, partly stifled laugh. Yeah. Then there's the sniff, to inhale forcibly through the nose, as in smelling. Mm -hmm. An act of sniffing, poach. <laughs> And then the sneer, the show of scorn, sneering look or remark. Yeah. And the sneaker. Oh, my gosh. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I've noticed how they sniff uh, when I walk into the library or different uh, places. Mm -hmm. It seems that the family is uh, of a different social structure than the American citizens that thought that you had an obligation to enforce the law. Mm hmm could you get me the sniff? Ooch. Judge? Mm. You know, this idea of being on somebody. Po. Where you sniff the individual? Ch Ch -ch -ch. I know that you think that your family's special. Mm -hmm. They're elected to office and they sit as judges and they sneer. Pooch. And they snickle. Oh. And you make snide remarks about how the poor American citizens just don't understand that you're in the family. <clears throat> now, when I think of the sneeze, oh, mm -hmm. you know, it's interesting uh, what you say when you sneeze. Mm -hmm. uh, when I was on Guam, the Navy had the sneeze. <laughs> Achoo. USA. Mm hmm Azusa. Oh. Why don't you get me the sneeze of each and every judge of the United States of America? And every time they sniffed somebody where they decide to put their dog on them. Because the dogs control those that are accused, don't they? Pouch! Isn't that right, pouch? The utterance? Mm -hmm. Dog? Mm. Now, when we take the sneeze... Mm -hmm. And the snivel poach and the snide remarks of those that are police officers that <laughs> look at the citizens as somebody they can abuse and we really can't do anything about it. I think you've sniffled your way into the belief that you're better than those that are citizens. Mm -hmm. Now, for every police officer that found out they were in the top secret family, <laughs> why don't you sniff this morning? <laughs> Sniff. Somebody had to be on the nose, cold noses. Yeah. You had to make dogs. Yeah. So that you could use the judicial system as a way to, well, more than enrich yourself, it's the ideology. Mm -hmm. Let's say you just make $150,000 a year as a judge and you sit there on the bench, Pope. And you look down upon the citizens that are accused of the various crimes. Yeah. And you make snide remarks. Oh, the guy's poor. He doesn't look very good. Uh -huh. His clothes are old. A little infrastructure of those that sniff. <clears throat> Judge Porter, I've heard you explain how your role <clears throat> as a judge yeah, is to protect the women and children. You've been sniffing mm -hmm, the population. You've been making snide remarks about mm -hmm, how it is that they just don't understand your importance. Yeah, kind of snickering at the various times that you decide to really throw the book at them. Poop. Well, we'll just put you in the can for a month. That'll teach you a fucking lesson right now. Snickering, sniffing, snide, remarking politicians that seem to think that these these uh, citizens, pooch, they're so far beneath you. Now, I sent you an email, and you seem to think that I need to make a phone call. I just informed you that I never got proof of actually being divorced. Mm-hmm. Then I send you an email that my wife's been neglecting and abusing my sons for seven and a half years. <laughs> and your answer is, well, I'll just put the dog on me and I'll sniff about it. I'll make snide remarks and <laughs> I'll just kind of uh, snicker poop, about how silly mm -hmm, 
how, how silly this is. You're the judge. There's no fucking way that you'll ever go to prison. Now, I'm the citizen that doesn't sniff the population. Mm -hmm. I don't want to be in your family. I don't want to come around. Ouch! Do you understand? Snickering, snide. Mm -hmm. Sniffing family. That thinks that what they're doing is so much better than not being snide, snickering, or sniffing. Listen, you piece of shit. I've documented so many crimes, and I'm sure today that there'll be some more documentation. But the uh, sheriff sniffing and snide and snickering at, oh, <laughs> yeah, we got that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You think it's fucking funny arresting people? You think it's funny arresting somebody for a crime where they weren't in Squim, Washington? <laughs> You like putting the handcuffs on a little too tight so as to cut off the circulation of the hands. <clears throat> you thought it was funny leaving my backpack in squim. Ouch! You're a snickering, snide, sniffing police department. The thinks you're so much better than all the other citizens. You know, going back to the Squim Police Department after being released from jail. Yes. And I think that arrest was for uh, 27 days, Judge. Yeah. Because of your abuse of power. I went back there and got my backpack. Yeah. I remember the secretary of the Squim Police Department. Yes. Yeah. Now, why don't we look at your sniffing today? Because as I understand the sniff. Yeah. That's your dog saying that I'm on the person. I'm going to be on a pouch. Do you fucking understand? Sneaker. God is sneaky, isn't he, Heidi? You know, when we were living at the Tamooning Plaza... Mm -hmm. Sometime around the birth of Benjamin. Yeah. When we were residents of Guam, Heidi woke up one day, one night actually. She said, God is sneaky. Oh, oh, oh. Why don't we call the CIA snip snip pooch number two? Mm. O'Sullivan, ouch. Then there's God of Robert Gates, Pooh, former secretary of uh, the Department of Defense. Yes. Why don't you get me all of those that are employed in the Department of Defense that like to play sneakers? It's a movie. <laughs> yes, it is. Just give me every fucking employee of the Department of Defense. Looks like you've been sneaking around. I never thought of God as sneaky. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But I think Robert Gates thought he was real sneaky. Mm -hmm. Now, as an old white-haired man... Mm -hmm, and a big-titted wife, Robert Gates. I'm going to make absolutely fuck right now. God. God is sneaky. I never... I've never seen God as being sneaky. But when my wife woke up and told me that, I thought, no. You know, when reading the Bible, Jesus did everything out in the open. Yeah. He did his miracles in front of the whole population. Pooch! He wasn't sneaky. Except for the time when he was alone with his own father praying. Now this violating of the privacy because of the sniffing of your dogs where you have to know every prayer of every citizen. Yeah. Sneaky. Call Robert Gates. Sneaker. And get me the tits of his fucking wife right now.